going to have a very brief tutorial today on audio silencing. And this is one of the things that's very, very instantly recognizable and very useful in terms of music production. And that is for certain types of material, in this case a bass guitar, we have undesirable artifacts that happen between the notes themselves. And in this case, that actually happens at the end of a loop that is being used in this bass performance. So what we're going to do is we're going to silence the end of that piece of audio. So I'm going to show you that area by highlighting it. You can see here that it has this handy bar up here. That's the focus. And that I can actually get in very, very tight right into that section. I can actually go back and zoom out. This function is very, very useful at getting at exactly the piece of audio you want to look at. So I can very quickly, when I drag my mouse up, it automatically turns this magnifying glass. I can zoom in and zoom out on the waveform itself. So I'm actually going to highlight that end of the piece of audio. And I'm going to right click and I'm going to silence that piece of audio. Or if I want to know my keyboard shortcuts, and I'm an actual keyboard shortcut fanatic, I love them. I'm going to press control space. This performs exactly the same function and that is it silences that audio. And I could go into other parts of the audio where perhaps there were undesirable sounds in between. Highlight that piece of audio and ensure there's nothing there and press control space as well. Now when I look at the entire waveform I can see that the loop has remained the same length but that undesirable sound at the end of the loop has now been removed.